Okay, everybody, this is a test recording. Um, I've tried using this piece of software in the past and I couldn't get it to work right. Um, so, one day I was on YouTube and I watched a, a video, this guy's video, and how he got the um, OBS Studio to record his desktop. And so I decided to give it a try. I downloaded it, I installed it, I used some of his settings. And if I can find the link to his video, I'll include it in the description below of this recording. And whatever. <laughs> so my question is, is uh, what settings do you use? When you use this piece of software, what settings do you use for whatever reason? And the reason why I'm asking is because maybe there's some better settings that I can use to give me a better quality recording. Yes, everybody loves quality. So, here's some information. Uh, a little bit information on my PC and the version of Windows 10. And what desktop screen recorders I've used in the past and no longer use and what screen recorders I still use and, and stuff like that so just read up on this yeah it's all on this little sticky note okay you see that? good <laughs> I'm open up this browser now nice little test recording Okay, this is what I'm using right now, Open Broadcaster Software, and as, as I said before, OBS Studio, and this is the latest release. It works on Windows, Mac, and Linux, and it's open source and it's free, and it's got a lot of features, you know. So far I like it, now that I know what settings to kind of use. And um, the flashback uh, by Blueberry Software, I use their free version called Flashback Express. Um, it doesn't work on my PC as good anymore. Whatever, I don't, I don't use it no more. What I do use is Bandicam, sometimes, I'm still using that. 10 minute recording, it's not bad. It's okay, has a watermark, I don't mind it. And there's this other one I just mentioned, ZD Soft. Did I mention ZD Soft in this stupid thing? Oh, I didn't. Oh, yes, I did. Yeah. ZD Soft screen recorder. You're probably wondering what that looks like, huh? Well, let's um, I'll try and do that quickly and show you here quickly. This is another one I no longer use. You know, right here, right in here. Okay, I'll type it in. Okay, yeah. Then this is why I don't use it. It used to be freeware with a watermark, and now it's a 30 day trial. Yeah, and I can't find the old version. But if you could find Screen Recorder version 10 by ZD Soft, um, that one will be free um, with a watermark for as long as you want. But now it's version 11 again with a 30 day trial. It turned over to be trial version, which is sad because it's pretty good software. No longer use it. So that's it, people. Not a very good uh, recording, <laughs> but it does record my screen, you know. Um, if you want to know what I think of the Windows 10 Fall Creators Update, I really don't notice anything different except a couple things. That, and I'm not going to get bothered showing you, but I will show you one thing. I'll show you one easy thing that's... I know that's different in this uh, version of Windows 10. Uh, Cortana is now in the Windows setting. 
has a little spot. And there is something different in the um, update security, but I'm not going to get into it because I want to stop recording now. Because I'm tired and I just want to go do something else now. So how does my audio sound? What do you think of the uh, visual quality at least um, of this re uh, recording on my desktop? What do you think? That's about it. Bye!